This video app review is brought to you by the iPhoneAppReview.com. Hey guys, this is Valerie Lauer with the iPhoneAppReview.com here with a video app review of a really awesome app we've had here this week called Smart Dict English. Um, this is a dictionary, thesaurus, word origin history, pronunciation information, one-stop shopping, basically, for any kind of information you want about a word in the English language. Um, now, this application costs 99 cents um, in iTunes in the market. It, it does come from a company called Linguatech, who has a great series of these out. There's one in Spanish, and there's also one in German. Um, and this is probably the best dictionary app, the street, you know, kind of as far as dictionary apps go, that I've seen ever. Um, it's a wonderful universal application. It works perfectly on the iPhone and the iPod Touch, but here we're looking at it on the iPad too. I think it makes beautiful use of the screen. This is again a universal application, um, so it is customized to work perfectly on this iPad and make the most of your screen, which I always love. So let's just kind of go through what happens when you look up a word and we'll go from there. Now it does, so I'll start here in the search section. So we'll say we want to search for tiger and search. And as you type letters and as you see, it kind of does, it does predictive searching. So if you don't know exactly how a letter, a word is spelled, just start typing it. You're going to get some ideas about what it's going to look like and you're probably going to find it on the list. Um, so when you find it, when you have the one you want, tap. So a great example of an entry is tiger. Now this one doesn't only have, just doesn't just have the information about the, you know, dic the definition of it. It also gives you photographs, which is beautiful. It gives you alternate forms, the etymology, which is the word origin, pronunciation guide. Um, and then you can also ha have access to other things like synonyms, translations in over 40 languages if, in a lot of these an anagram, related terms, derived terms, in other words, everything. <laughs> Anything you could possibly want to know about this word is here, which is really, really amazing. Um, also, the images that come through and all the content is offline. So if you get this application and you don't have a data connection and you still want to use it, it's all there. So you don't have to worry about, oh no, am I going to get in trouble for using data and running at the bill? Just not going to happen. Now also on any of these search results, there are some dedicated icons. One is this icon right here, which is the table of contents. Anything in the, that, that search result that you want to look at, say, you, say you're only interested in the, in the definition. That's all you have to look at. You know, any of the other ones you can actually minimize to get them out of your way. So you only have to look at what you want to look at and just tap it again to access it. So really, really simple. The search function is available on any screen by tapping the search icon. Amazing. Um, there's also a great, great thing, which is the settings icon. The settings icon takes you to, to through a lot of different things. It lets you make one your favorite. It lets you type out and add a note. Tigers are great. And then we're done. And now you have a note icon here on the side and you can tell it it's your favorite. You can also go off the app to search for online images for any kind of word, any, any term you come across whether it has an, eye, an image or not, which is wonderful. Um, and you can access right from here your search history, any words you've ever looked up. You can also access your favorites, any words you have as a favorite, and you can access your notes, any notes you've ever made about a word. Now some other really cool features in here, one is the font size, so you can change this to whatever you'd like it to be, that way if you want it to be a little bit bigger so it's easier to read, you definitely can, um, especially if you're using that smaller screen on the iPhone, that can come in handy. And then my personal option <laughs> here is that there are all these great color schemes that come with the application. I personally think Candy Girl is perfect. I love the bright pink header, I love the crazy colors, and that's what I think is wonderful. There's also, I breezed past it, there's also um, an information I, option here too, just to learn some more about the other apps from Linguatech and you know, an option to review it. So, very cool. There's also some share options right from there. Um, and I just, again, just think this application is so high quality. Uh, that you can find anything you're looking for, the massive information is here, the extra content, it's well laid out, it's beautifully made, and I absolutely love it. So we gave this application a 5 out of 5 stars. Um, I'm in love with it as a dictionary app. It's a great price for 99 cents. It's much smaller and cheaper than actually even just a regular dictionary is going to be. 
So you really can't go wrong downloading Smart Dict English. Um, again, this has been Valerie Lauer with the iPhoneAppReview.com. Until next time.